Alright, bring it in. Bring it on in. Um, I'm, I'm going to try to make it through the night without showing you. If we can do it. So, let's see if we can do it. So, uh, we'll, we'll work from a little bit flatter posture. So, we've been working from pretty decent posture. So, let's work on um, getting back to our posture when things go a little bit haywire. So, uh, down got cross face. Right, he starts to flatten me out there. So I, I sort of uh, I gave up. I gave up this side. Didn't work out real well for me here. So uh, he managed to get the cross face. And what you can even get a like, shoulder justice. Yeah. So now he's got like a shoulder justice type cross face here. Yeah. There. So pretty typical posture here. I got caught. Uh, luckily, my arm is still underneath my body here, so he didn't get the underhook on the far side. But he did get the cross face on the near side. So, uh, rather than try to uh, work from this posture, I'm going to work to get my posture back. I want to regain my good posture. Uh, so, I want to begin to swim this arm back in. I need to create some space. If I try to tuck this arm in now, I'm not, there's no space for me to get it in. So I'm going to have to use the, one of the two pressures I got, which is my upa pressure. So from here, I'm going to upa into him a little bit, and that'll create some space for me to get my arm in, and I'm going to swim it up, and I'm going to bring it up as high as I can like this. See my fingers? And then now what I'm going to do is I'm going to move my head to my fingers. And I'm going to, I'm going to crawl up my, my head with my fingers. So I'm going to touch, crawl up like that, and then that'll make a frame there. And then I'm gonna upa again, and then break out. So, two-step process. I'm flat, 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 flat. I need an upa to get my arm in, create some space, get my arm in, get it as high as I can. He's gonna flatten that back out. I'm gonna move my head to my fingers, walk it up, and then upa into him again. And you see what he has to do? He's gotta move his arm out at that point, and then I'm back here. So I'm in a good posture. So without John on me, I get caught flat. He's got the cross face here. I upa, insert, bring it up as high as I can here. Bring my head to my hand, walk, and it makes a nice frame there. Really nice frame. Because my elbow's into my body here like that. Then I'm upa into him again, which case he either has to post out, or if he doesn't post out, I got a nice frame, I just turn it out. Boom, and now I'm back in my posture like that. So I'm back to a good posture, rather than allowing him to have the cross face and then trying to escape crazy stuff from here. I want to do that. Okay, let's try that with the partner.